Good morning and <clears throat> welcome to the last ever, last day of Soul Survivor ever. I'm here just walking back from breakfast with my brother Andrew. <laughs> last day? <laughs> the tears have already begun. And um, we're looking forward to what we hope will be a good day, aren't we, Andrew? Oh, last day. <laughs> um, <gasps> I've got quite a busy day Compose coming yourself. up. You can do this, Andrew. I've got quite a busy day coming up. I've got two seminars in Cafe Uno, which I think is quite a fitting place to do it, don't you, Andrew? It's a fitting finale, some might say, Chris. Thanks, Andrew. I'm doing my seminar on the whole Bible in 45 minutes, talking about every single book in the Bible, all 66 of them, in 45 minutes. And then I'm doing one called Jesus Every Day. Uh, which is kind of about how do we keep meeting with God even when we're not yeah. in this exceptionally hot campsite um, going to the big top with all these thousands of people. So hopefully they'll go well. But before that, this morning, <coughs> we've got the final ever communion service at Soul Survivor ever. So I'll be delivering communion to people, which is yeah. very exciting. Chris, are you? Sadly, I've not been asked, Andrew. <laughs> So I will be receiving the communion. From your brother? Well, it depends if I sit near you or not. You might get like the gluten-free one, which is yeah. not very nice. So I won't be coming to that. Um, so that's what we're looking forward to today. Also, there is uh, some fun stuff going on well, tonight. In the morning, actually. Oh. There's also going to be praying for youth leaders. Youth leaders, yep. And hopefully, maybe the gift of tongues will be dispersed among those who don't have it yet. Ah, shalabala bala bala. Shalabala bila bala. Biddy biddy biddy. <laughs> so, we'll see what happens there. Maybe we'll film it. We'll go around no. the tent. <laughs> I don't think we will, Chris. Let's <laughs> not joke about such things. Okay, right sorry, we won't really. Just in case anyone watches this, no. we, we, weren't, we aren't going to do that. That may be cut out of this video. <laughs> One of the things uh, that I want to do today is I want to I want to be able to take home with me the Cafe Uno sign. I've already requested it from the powers that be. Um, and as long as um, things don't get looted, then hopefully I will end up with that later tonight as a souvenir, a Soul Survivor souvenir. Is there any souvenirs you're after, Andrew? I'd like, potentially, if this is possible, I'd like to get the big top. The big top. The whole big top? Yeah. Have you got room in your car? I'm hoping so. Cool. Ah, nearly <laughs> fell over then. <laughs> okay, so Andrew's wanting the big top. Um, all I want is my cappuccino sign and maybe a lock of Mike Pilavach's hair. Mm. I'd like a lock of his shirt, to be honest. A lock of his shirt. Yeah. Okay. Um, and finally, um, we were trying to think what are the what are the cool things that we've remembered from Soul Survivor. Some of the great worship leads we've had: Kevin Prosh, Matt Redman, Tim Hughes, David the Heat, Roos. the Heat Band, the Heat Band, yeah, <laughs> David Roos, yeah. Some of the cracking speakers and experiences we've had over the years. And um, it's a shame that's going to come to an end now, but there is a future, um, and there's lots of new things starting next year. So we'll, uh, we'll decide what we're going to go to. And uh, so after, late after this bit, we'll, uh, I'll probably put on a few kind of little highlights of the day. Uh, but thanks for listening on our journey Chris, back to our bunker bin. Chris, why don't you put a few highlights of our time at Soul Survivor on as well, where what? we just give anecdotes, different stories of the different things that have happened over these last 20 odd years. I could do, but... It I've already, this, this video is already 4 minutes 20 seconds, so I okay, don't know how Chris. long it should be. People will probably stop watching anyway by now. Yeah, it's only me and you that are going to be watching at this point. So maybe we'll make a second video, like, when we get home, and we can talk about our anecdotes. Okay, Chris. See you in a bit.